You don't have to be a florist to put together a gorgeous corsage, and you don't even need real flowers. We'll show you how to make a faux floral corsage that you can treasure long after the special occasion. For the majority of our corsage, we're using a ready-made bouquet to take the guesswork out of choosing and coordinating florals. But don't be afraid to pull in additional florals. Use wire cutters to snip the pieces off the bouquet that you want to use. You'll want to keep in mind what you want your focal element to be. We're going with the succulent. You'll use the leaves and stems to create the base of the corsage. Layer them into two small bunches facing in opposite directions. Be sure to keep them fairly symmetrical. Arrange the two bunches together on a piece of ribbon, layering one on top of the other. Then use a floral tie to hold it all together. To make your corsage look clean and finished, it's a good idea to tie a knot with a ribbon to hide the underside. Now it's time for the focal point. Hot glue the succulent to the base and press down firmly until it's dry. This is a good time to look at your base and figure out if you want to add more florals. If so, just hot glue additional florals into the arrangement until it's full and balanced. Another trendy option is to add a ready-made cuff from our jewelry department. Just tie the corsage to the cuff with the ribbon and you're done. This is a fun alternative to the traditional corsage and it will make the recipient feel so special. Remember, we have lots of floral stems in the store, so it's easy to make a corsage that coordinates with any outfit. For more DIY inspiration, subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to live a creative life.